Hey everyone, welcome to the Pocahontas Challenge. So the first part, uh, you need to have your black castor oil and then later on we're going to do a GHE which is a greenhouse effect. So I'll be using this Tropical Isle Jamaican black castor oil. This is a staple product for me. I love this. My hair loves this. So the first part of it is to moisturize. To moisturize, I'll be using the Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula Hair Milk. This has a little bit of protein which my hair really likes and it strengthens my hair. But I'll only be using this when my hair is out. If I have braids in, I'll be using a braid spray. You need to start off by applying the product to the tips of your hair and working your way up as well as in between each section. Part 2 involves oiling your scalp. Oiling your scalp is really important because this is where your hair grows from. So you want to make sure that your scalp is healthy. When you pour out the oil, you don't want to use a lot per section. You just need to use about the size of a 5 cent coin. You dab on that using your fingertips. Make sure to spread the product with your fingertips to emulsify as well as warm up the oil. Part 3 is sealing the oil. So whenever I use Jamaican black castor oil, there will be a little bit of a residue left because this is a very thick oil. So I just use the residue to seal up the moisture that I had put into my hair. A very important aspect to this challenge is massaging. You want to massage your scalp, focusing on your problem areas such as your edges or your nape, which is at the back of the head. Part 4 is the greenhouse effect. Greenhouse effect is when you first put a moisturizer onto your hair and then you cover it up with a shower cap or a big plastic bag if you have braids in. You can put on the cap or bag for at least an hour to overnight, depending on your preference. Whenever you remove your cap, you can expect to have damp hair. Damp hair is a good sign of moisturized and happy hair. You don't need to worry about the oil. You can just tie up your hair, tie up your braids. If you have bantu knots in, it'll be fine. Don't wash it out. This will be my starting length for the challenge. I will see you guys in the next three months. Thank you very much for watching.